Hello everyone, you're Kai, okay mom, Chi Chi here, and I'm back with another Game of Thrones Telltale series Let's Play. Now, the first one didn't do too well. I mean, it did okay, but it didn't do too well, but I'm going to go through a second episode to see how you guys take to it. If not, then we're probably not going to continue this series, but we're going to get on to part two, chapter one. Shall we? Right, we left off in the Forester Lands. In the King's Road. This guy looks so sad. Well, I, I can't blame him. I mean, he did he, he did lose a friend. Oh, look, a pig! So, use L to move, R to look around. Okay. Okay, so, I want to pet the pig! Come here! What's this? I guess we're looking at the blood? Wait, why is there blood on the ground? What's going on? Fresh. Someone was hurt. So we're walking, what's this? <gasps> the pig is dead! Who would kill that poor piggy? I will murder any, whoever killed that pig! So, there's something going on over there, apparently. So, I guess we'll... Where are we going, exactly? What's this? It's a cart. Why are we walking so slow? That's father's car. Oh, snap! That's not good. Lord Bolton better give us fucking titles for this. Better maybe oh, there's something going on over here. Bacon. <laughs> Those poor pigs! You murderers! I mean, I love bacon as much as anybody else, but... Come along, boy. There's nothing for you here. <laughs> oh, really? Father, I said move on. I recognize you. You're a forester squire. Former Stark Bannermen have no claim on land anymore. Or haven't you heard? No, I don't think I've heard. The Starks are dead. And what's that got to do with me? Where'd you get that sword? Wouldn't you like to know? Not a chance that sword is his. Must have stolen it. Out here by himself. I killed a man for it. Probably a Because I'm that savage. Ah, I, I killed a man for it. Did you? Now why don't I believe you? Fine, don't believe me. That sword's too big for you, boy. You can barely. Where's pick my it hashtag out. big red stick? I'll oh, I'll, I'll my land. I'll it's mess him up. Bolton land now, boy. Lord Bolton is the new warden of the North. I reckon he like a proper lordly sword like that. <laughs> yeah, dodged it. Nice try. <laughs> oh, that was close. I was hit the wrong button. <laughs> I'll have that sword, boy. No, you won't. It's mine. Come get, get it. it, you bastard. Exactly. Uh, oh! Uh, oh, come on. That ain't even fair. All right. Finish this fucking pig farmer. Pathetic. Hey, I'm not a pig farmer. Are a pig I want to stab him with this. This looks more fun. No! Take! Oh! Oh, I think he's dead from that. Oh, come on. You want some too? You missed. morning get off man that hurts don't 
Look it up. Please. Why should I show you mercy? You didn't even show mercy to those pigs. The love will survive without me. Oh, the whole family shtick. I was only following orders. Fine, fine. You better not do anything stupid. Thank you. I will kill you where you lay. Yeah, you better run. You will see you hang for this. Yeah, let's just see him try. I promise. Got an achievement for that too. Neat. Um, father? Garrett, you survived. Of course he survived. Your, your sister. She hid. Wait, I have a sister? Oh! Well, she tried to hide, apparently. Didn't work out for her. I tried to stop them. You did your best. Oh no! Why do all the good people die in this th in these things? I don't get it. I'll kill the men who did this. I agree with you. So now we're in Iron Wrath. How are you still walking with that wounded in or with that wounded leg of yours? I know that's gotta it's hurt. Garrett. Get the castellan. Tell him his nephew survived. Oh, this place is really pretty. Hey, Garrett. there we go. I was too late. They were already dead. Bring the maester. Meet that us really in the sucks. great hall. Quickly. Poor guy just lost his family. Or at least his dad and his sister. I don't know if he has Two any more White family. Hill soldiers and a Bolton. They killed my family. And for what? For pigs, sister, apparently. She was only eight years old. This never would have happened with the Starks in power. It's... Unimaginable. Unacceptable. You have my condolences. Well, thank you. Thank you, Mister. Mm, the blade cut deep, but I should be able to save your leg. Well, that's a good thing. Your justice was swift. That Some sounded like it vengeance. hurt a little bit. No doubt the White Hills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. I'd do it again. I'd do it again if I had the chance. If we don't respond with strength, they won't stop until they have everything. These maggots. Well, then we probably need an army. Hold the wound open for me, would you? Oh, this is gonna hurt. <laughs> oh, that just looked. Ugh. Oh, what? What is he? What? These are dark days, I fear. To lose are those the maggots? The house and the Why would you put maggots in a war? What is... What? And betrayal. I, I'm not even going to question Winter it. The houses and hours have fallen in times such as this. That's just disgusting. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. We can avenge them. A serious them. man, but he would have made a good lord. Roderick and Lord Forrester. We can avenge them. And attack House Frey. Now is the time to find allies, not enemies. I guess he's not wrong. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. I guess if we, Whatever you know, we try to avenge him now, we, we kind of fail. We kind of need an army for that. Right. Uh, this might hurt a bit. Hold this for me, will you? I still want to know what was with the maggots. What are those supposed to do? Forest to save your life. He did. Rather odd, though, that he chose to save you, his squire, and not his son, Roderick. Because I'm better, maybe? Not that Roderick couldn't handle himself. He was as good with a sword as any man I've seen. That's not what happened, That's though. That's not how it happened. Roderick had already fallen. Hmm. Although I'd imagine Lord Forrester would sacrifice himself to save anyone from his house, high or low. You're not maybe wrong. Forrester will be here any moment now. I'd like you to walk for me first, to see if you can put any weight on that leg. It's gonna hurt. But I'll try. 
but for just getting stitched, she's walking rather normally. Go on. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. Let's go look at the Lord's chair. Can we sit in it? And for just getting a stitch, he sure is walking normally. Let's see, what else can I find? A window. The Ironwood Grove. That's all you're gonna say? Okay then. Okay, so we're walking, we're walking. What are we walking to exactly? Oh, look, a picture. Let's look at it. Mira. Mira? Still in King's Landing, I suppose. Although. I wonder if they'll bring her home. Who's this? Lady Forrester? Lady Forrester. She's always been kind to me. Treated me like I was a Forrester myself. Ryan. Ryan. So this is like a whole family. Fourth born son. Talia and Ethan. I suppose Lord Ethan now. We gotta go through all these people. Ash. Ash's Ash's got a stick. Us, unfortunately. Oh, that is unfortunate. Lord Forrester, it was an honor to squire for him. Gregor the Good. Roderick, he was our best warrior by Poor far. Poor Roderick. We'll miss, he'll be missed. Okay, so now what? Hmm, you seem to be favoring it. Always sad to see a warrior lose a leg. I, I'm fine, Mr. Ottengren. Look, I'll show you. Keep moving. I need to see you walk. Don't tell me what to do. Let's see, what's on this table? A bucket. Ew. I still don't understand this. Rather cute little creatures, aren't they? I guess. Uh, not really. They're kind of gross. Bandages. Guess I'm taking that with me. Could come in handy later. This might help. Like I'm just taking his stuff. I show my sword to him. It's a good thing you've done, bringing that back to House Forrester. By right, that belongs to Lord Ethan now. Well, that still sword mine. has been handed down through 50 generations of foresters. He can't have it. Did your leg feel weak? No. I just wanted to ask you. Hmm. Why did the white heels, heels hate us? Hate the foresters? I think it's safe to say the feeling is mutual. There's been enmity between the two houses for as long as anyone can remember. I don't doubt someone killed someone, which led to more killings of someone's, and then, well, here we are. That's unfortunate. Who's the Who's new lord the of the new house? Lord of house Forrester. Why, Ethan, of course. I thought so. At the Citadel, I swore an oath to serve whichever noble house I was assigned. Advising the late Lord Forrester was an honor. Advising Ethan, his third-born son, is challenging. There's still so much he has to so learn. So he's a youngin. The very fate and future of this house rests in his hands. That doesn't really know too much which yet. Which is rather frightening when you think about it. So why hire him for the seat? What, what will become me? me now? Excellent question. Hmm. Under normal circumstances, you could join Sir Roiland and his men. Although, given the circumstances of your circumstances, why is he it talking like trick, that? Doesn't it? I suppose it will be for Lord Ethan. To decide. Well, I guess Lord we're going Forrester to Lord Ethan. Me. At the twins, I, I'm no longer a squire, if that matters. I mean, it I don't see why I wouldn't. But I'll defer to Lord Ethan on this. The White Hills want Forrester Ironwood. 
Ah, they'd take it all if we'd let them. Especially now with the Boltons in power. And proceed to clear cut every I last the inch of it until were there's nothing interesting left, people. Just as they've done before. Can I see Ethan? Is he here? He is. But I'm afraid he's indisposed. At the indisposed? Moment. He prefers not to be disturbed while practicing his loot. Oh, so he's he's too busy for me. I get it. Can I go now? I believe your leg will be fine. Only time will tell, but Oh, who's this? Lady Forrester. Oh, it's Lady Forrester. Welcome home, Garrett. We're all relieved to know you survived. Well, of course I survived. Talia asked to see you. Garrett, I heard what happened. Is it true? Your family... Unfortunately, it is. I'm so sorry. Nato. I ship these two. Just saying. Off to bed now. Hurry on. Garrett was just telling me how valiantly Lord Forrester fought to the end, even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. He saved, saved my, my life. life, my lady. Yet not Roderick's. You we didn't really have a choice. I'm sure it was chaos just... and confusion. But if you can remember anything, I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. I'm sorry, my lady. Nothing could be done to save him. Exactly. He was we tried. His best. Just a lot of things happened at one time. We couldn't really react. This has been so incredibly difficult for us, especially the children. But I was told, I was told you were the last to see my husband alive. Well, yes, yeah. My lady. I know it may be difficult to remember, but if I may ask, was there anything he said? Oh snap! There Any was last something words he said before he passed. If you can remember. He said he loved you. He said he loved you. I know that's not exactly what he said, but we kind of got to lie to make this work. You have the Forester's sword. This belongs I have to, to make Ethan her feel now. better. He's the new lord of the house. Thank you, Garrett. Of course, my lady. It demands a response. It's too dangerous, Wait, especially what? now. Now is the time to prove our strength. I'll be sure it's given to Ethan. Oh, but that was my sword! Duncan, this was our now land. Now what the heck am I supposed they to use? our people. Your family. I share your outrage, Sir Roiland. I do. But now is not the time to provoke the White Hills. Not with Ramsay Snow coming to see us bend Oh, great, the Ramsay. Ramsay Snow, I remember him from the show. Everybody hates Ramsay. Garrett, do you understand what this means? You killed a Bolton, and Ramsay Snow will want his retribution. Well, let him have it. We're the ones that should be demanding retribution. They killed, they killed my family. family. And exactly. They'll pay for what they've done. That much I promise. But now is not the time for vengeance. It's not now. When? Exactly. We have to be smart. Ramsay Snow will be here within the week. And what would you have us do? Nothing. I would have us use our heads while they're still attached to our shoulders. Exactly. Just that get a little bit of an army and we'll mess them up. Else. Maybe you can talk some sense into your uncle. Garrett suffered enough already. You asked too much of the boy. I, mean, I agree. We do need to be smart My about this. right. We need to be smart. Smart. Edward Stark was smart. And look where that got him. So. Well, apparently he wasn't smart enough then. <sighs> Ultimately, it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. He's just a boy who can barely hold a sword. He knows nothing of how to lead men. Well, then we're going to teach house, him. And he needs our help. It's bad enough the Boltons would have us bend the knee and swear fealty. But now, this. But I'll accuse you of murder and us of protecting you. The boy was just defending himself. It wasn't not murder. not him for what he did. It wasn't murder. It was justice. Exactly. Not in their eyes. Well, it's just favorite word. Ramsay Snow would Justice. need to put us to the torch and kill us all. I'd like to see them try. I'm afraid it's well, a risk we cannot word, but take. They're the same person, so you cannot stay. You get my point. Cannot stay, Duncan. The boy has suffered enough. Let them come. Let them come. I don't care. They'd kill you and not think twice about it. It's not safe for you here, Garrett. There's only one place beyond the reach of the Boltons. We can put up a decent fight. You're sending him to the wall. Wait, what? The boy's done nothing wrong. Not in the eyes of the Boltons. So you're sending me to the wall I'm where it's cold it's and snowy. My place Uncle, is here. 
My place is here. Who will defend the house? You said we need men who can Exactly! Fight. There'd be nothing we could do to protect you. To stay would bring destruction upon us all. Well, then learn to be better! I know that's not what you want. I know it's difficult to understand. It's still not right. It's still not right. No, it's not. But it's what's best. Damn it, Duncan! That settles it, then. I don't want to go where it's snowy and you cold. Have my horse, and I'll see you have plenty of food. Don't see how generous of you. The White Hills will come looking for you. You guys are no fun. Were it up to me, I'd gladly drive a sword through Lord Whitehill's heart if given the chance. I agree. Can we just I do will. that instead? If God's willing, someday I will. But for now, I have House Forrester to consider first. Oh, nice horse. I know you want to stay. But Lord Forrester would be proud that you're putting the interests of the house ahead of your own. Many I of get Lord it, Forrester's I get it. best men have volunteered for the war. I'll do what's best. I'll do what's best. Which you don't have to like it, but easiest, I'll do it. But necessary, nonetheless. I've been waiting for the right moment to tell you. Wait, tell him what? What? What is it? Lord Forrester asked me to give you a message. Oh yeah, that's right. He said, the North Grove can never be lost. Sorry. I had to fulfill my duty. My surprise. It's not often discussed, if ever. He said, "Tell only you." For good Apparently reason. Apparently, he trusts you. Most don't even know it exists. They think it's just a myth made up by wildlings and fools, and it's better kept that way. So nobody else knows about I it. Apparently, you kept your word. Well, you I kind of had to. Anyone else, have you? This is important, Garrett. Of I've told no not. one. I told no one. Well done. Lord Forrester was right to put his trust in you. Well, obviously. From this day forward. Why would I tell anybody else if he tells me to tell one but soon, I may one particular well, person? I can't say anything more just yet. Just know the North Grove may very well be vital to the future of this house. Oh. But don't breathe a word of it to anyone at the wall. Become a yeah, ranger. Yeah, yeah, I get it. It will help. A ranger? Wait, does that mean I get to use bows or whatnot? Iron from ice. Iron from ice. Remember, you represent House Forrester. Your actions at the wall will reflect the honor and dignity I'll of the I'll serve with honor. I'll serve with honor. I know you will. I approve of his uncle. I know, I know he's just looking out for my safety. It just sucks. Garrett, wait. What's that? Oh! Wait. Whose necklace is that? Be safe. I think she likes him. I approve. It's kind of a sad moment when you're leaving home. Ethan? That's a very pretty force. Ethan Forrester? Oh, this is that Ethan they were talking about. Wait, is he really that young? I couldn't find him. Could you? He hides too well. And if he was smart, he would reveal himself. Oh, I feel like they're playing hide and seek. Maybe something happened to him. Ethan's fine. He's just forgotten this is a game. You found me. Well done, Ryan. So this oh, is the Lord? 
It's just a game, Ryan. A stupid game. I don't like it. He was worried you were gone. I thought we'd never find you worried. Again. I'm right here. And I promise, I'm not going anywhere. I wish Mira was here. And Asha. And... And Roderick. Well, sadly, the, too. the man's dead. Mira's in King's Landing and... Can't she come home? I don't want her to die too. Ryan, she's perfectly safe, I promise you. Well, you can't blame him for worrying. He won't get to die either. Maester Ortengrin said he got sent to the wall. Poor kid. I'll miss Garrett. He was nice. Garrett is smart. Fine. Garrett is smart. No one will tell me what Garrett did, but it must have been serious. I heard Duncan and Sir Roiland talking. They said someone will come here looking for revenge. Yeah, most likely, because everybody me. loves but revenge. I know you'll protect us. Who said they're worried about me? Well, Sir Roiland for one. He says you can't fight very well. What? And he told you. He told you a milksop. The, a milksop? The heck is a milksop? Sir Roiland forgets himself. After all, you are the lord of the house now. He doesn't know me or, or what I'm capable of. I can't believe that the lord is that young. I don't know, but I know it's not good. Ethan, you should let Sir Roiland teach you how to wield a sword. Like, like a man. Yeah, be a man! He taught Roderick and Asher, and he even showed me how to fight. Properly, I mean. A lord should know how to fight. He's not wrong. <laughs> if you're gonna be a lord, you gotta, you gotta prepare for whatever comes to you. Me, Roderick, Asher. We'd all be out here for hours. Yeah! Where was I? You weren't born yet. We had so much fun. But then, well, then everything changed. Roderick became so serious, the Lord in training, and he never smiled anymore. And Asher... He just got all Asher serious. just got angry at everything. Well, people change. Promise me you won't be like that. Please, just be you. I like you the way you are. Be you would be a better Lord. I know a Lord has many responsibilities. But you don't need to be like them. I don't want to get angry, but I may have to. Father did Exactly, sometimes. it just depends on the situation. But you're nice. Everybody says that about you. I love where oh, they're at, by the way. It's very pretty. You're the new lord. You can do anything you want. I suppose. Everyone will have to do as you say. So I could have all the sweets I want. I'll do it. Really? It's that simple. It would be nice if someone did what I wanted for once. How it works. So how it works. Well, that's how it should work. You are the Lord. Doesn't mean you can have all the candy you want. Dinner first, then candy. Lord Ethan, you're needed in the Great Hall at once. Quickly, on your feet. Wonder what he could be needed for. What's the matter? Lord Whitehill has arrived. Unannounced. And certainly unexpected. Oh, snap! He's come demanding justice. Well, that's not good. Can't he meet with Duncan? He is the Castellan. Stay with us. Please, Ethan. He's demanding an audience with the Lord. We really must go. It's well, I guess we decision. have no choice. You are the Lord. If I were Lord, I would command Ethan to stay with his family. I might remind you, Sir Royland, I'm the new Lord of House Forrester. Not you. Exactly. So don't be demanding of course, me. My lord. It's okay. You should go. It's what must be done. Never Fine. said I wasn't going to go, but this guy it. doesn't have to demand me. How dare he? a good place to end it everybody we'll, we'll leave it at a little bit of a cliffhanger to see what happens the next time this way i know if you guys want more of this or not but if you're, if you're new to the channel make sure to subscribe if you want more of my content and, be, and if you're not new make sure you hit that like button and comment below if you want you want me to play more of this and make sure you hit that notification bell so you're notified of when my videos go up but until next time everybody kyle k bye now go do your homework